What's up everybody? My name's Cameron Chatterton with Chatterton Homes Group, powered by Twin Oaks Real Estate. Today, we are in Kensington, California. Now, I don't know if you know Kensington at all, but it is a little unincorporated area between Berkeley and El Cerrito. And today I wanna show you guys 540 Kenyon Ave. And this is a three bed, two bath, with 1,938 square feet on the interior. The entire lot size is 10,500 square feet. I'm excited to show you inside because it has been fully remodeled inside and out. So let's take a look, head on inside and have some fun. Welcome inside everybody. Talk about natural light. The entire Northwest wall is just glass panels from floor to ceiling. You get a ton of natural light in here. We're here in the afternoon, and right now it's gorgeous in here. I feel like you're kind of, you're lifted above as well, which is nice, and then you have this surrounding deck with this door that leads out to it. So this deck actually goes all the way lengthwise, all the way down the front of the house. You're able to come out here. You can even see the Golden Gate Bridge as well, which is really cool. It's a little overcast today. To look out there, you can still see the lines of the bridge on a really, really nice day. You see it clear as ever. Really cool spot with a beautiful view. You got a fireplace in the living room as well. They painted this nice mantle, wood mantle, uh, original that actually matches the built-in book cabinets behind you. So they have these built-in cabinets. They didn't touch them at all when they did the remodel, which I personally really enjoy because it adds like a nice aesthetic, a nice touch, a nice feel from what the house used to be, and it makes it feel really, really warm inside. You've got the original flooring throughout the home as well. They didn't touch them. Two inch white oak planks that go through. New recessed lights throughout that leads us over into our living room. So you got your family room as you first enter, and then you got your living room as you come on down. And like I said, again, those glass panels that continue down this wall too. Really cool with these glass panels. You know, it gets hot during the summertime and everything. They have these safari windows. I call them safari windows. I actually don't know the exact name of them, uh, but you can basically turn them open and get some airflow in them. And they're actually every single window on the bottom has these. They didn't replace them because I don't think they're made anymore. Staging did an amazing job in here as well. Looks beautiful. You've got a new sliding door that leads out to our backyard, which we'll see a little bit later. But let's go on uh, into the kitchen and see what was done there. Welcome to your brand new kitchen, fully remodeled from top to bottom. The devil is right in the details to me. So they waterfalled the end of the peninsula, but they book matched the veins. So that's one continuous vein across. I think they did a great job, even the detailing here, the edge detail. So for that waterfall and the waterfall along the countertop on this side, they match the veins here. I think they did a great job with it. There used to be a wall that came out all the way to the edge of this peninsula. They removed that wall and added the peninsula with an Eden kitchen, new pendant lights, brand new quartz countertop, along with our shaker white cabinets that go all throughout the kitchen, all brand new, every single one of them. They went with the gold features for the handles on all the white shaker cabinets, full pull out, and then soft close, which is great. You gotta have it. You don't wanna be slamming them shut. Brand new stainless steel sink, black faucet, quartz backsplash as well, which I love. They really just wrapped it all up together. Brand new stainless steel appliances. You got the new fridge, new oven, new dishwasher. You got the white hood to match the white walls behind it. And then you have this pot filler. Not many people have these. And honestly, it's a lifesaver. Say you got like 10 people over and you're cooking spaghetti for everybody and you got this massive pot. You just put it right here and start filling it up with water immediately. You don't gotta go to the sink and then try to lift that thing back over and place it on top of the stove. Really, really love this kitchen. Brand new tile flooring as well. One of my favorite parts of this whole thing though is behind us. If we come and take a look, this is still from the original house. They got a farmhouse door. It's one of my favorite things. It's the small, little, simple things that I love in a house and this is one of them. I don't know, Ruben, have you ever lived in a house with a farmhouse door? No, I like it though. 
I love it. Dinner's ready. You can just yell at everybody. It's perfect. We're gonna go take a look at the bedrooms. Follow me. Let's have some fun. Before we make it over to the bedrooms, I just wanna point out all the doors you see and the handles, all of them are brand new. Brand new doors and handles. We've got some storage closets here in the hallway. I wanna open them up. You know what they look like. New fixtures down the hallway as well. And then we're gonna be stepping on into bedroom number one. It's our first one. Brand new windows in this bedroom. New fixture light overhead, full paint throughout. Again, same flooring continued throughout the entire home besides the kitchen and the bathrooms. It's that two inch white oak planks. And then you've got your mirrored closet here, brand new windows. And I love this because it looks out to the backyard, but it feels like there's a ton of privacy in this home, which is nice. There's a lot of foliage. There's a ton of trees that really make this kind of feel secure in, in a private area, which is nice. All right, bedroom number dos. Coming on in here, again, brand new windows. You got a brand new light fixture as well. Continued flooring, closet in here too. This is a pretty big one. I mean, they put two beds in here for staging. Uh, and then off the one side, you have the backyard that goes off of the primary, which I'm gonna show you in a second. And then you have the other backyard that leads out from the family room, living room, kitchen area. You know, great bedroom, nicely done. And uh, it's a big one. Okay, so now we have bath number one. Now this was fully remodeled. They did such a good job at this one. You walk in, new tile. I love the tile, hexagon tiles on the floor. Double sink vanity with your white shaker, black fixtures, black faucets, the black rimmed mirror with the new fixture lights up above as well. They did a really good job on this. It's nice, it's sleek, it's simple. New toilet and then all brand new bathtub with the tile in the background. And I honestly have to tell you, I want these green tiles. I might have to put them in my bathroom. Vertical tiles in the back with horizontal on the sides in the white. I love this green color. I think it looks so good. Huge, huge fan with the black fixtures again to match the, the vanity fixtures as well with the double sink. They did a really nice job in this one. Again, brand new doors in here. Very well done. All right, now let's take a look at our primary bedroom. So again, brand new door and handles. You got your double closet, his, hers, 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 his, his, whatever you wanna do. Brand new light fixture up top in the middle, new windows. This is a nice and actually pretty large primary bedroom. And it leads us over, brand new barn door. Who doesn't love a barn door? It's got the farmhouse feel throughout the entire house. We're single level. Opening up that barn door to your brand new primary bathroom. Your water closet, whatever you'd like to call it. You got a single sink vanity with the quartz countertop. Again, white shaker, different fixtures than the other bathroom. They've got kind of like this envelope kind of fold on them. I actually really like these a lot. Brand new toilet, hexagon tiles down below. And then into our shower, you've got the vertical white tiles with the niche in the corner, the black pebble uh, shower pan. Huge, I love this shower with the a uh, fixed glass panel as well, black fixtures. Done just very nice, very sleek. They did a really good job in here. Black fixture up above the vanity as well. It looks beautiful, very well done. Now, my favorite part of this primary bedroom is they added a French door. So two French doors, right, equal to one French door, leading out to your own private patio. What a cool little addition to your primary bedroom to have your own private patio off of your new French doors. You have your own private backyard off of the primary as well, which is really cool. There's a little gate over there that leads to the other backyard, but this is kind of your own little private spot, which is cool. I love it. You grab your coffee in the morning, your breakfast, you come out here, you hang out a little bit, get some sun before you start your day. Now I have one more thing to show you downstairs. It's a nice little addition, a little bonus to the home, if you will. So let's take a look, head on downstairs. Now, after you enter into the garage downstairs, you do have a bonus room, storage area. You could turn this into an office, a playroom, a game room, maybe, whatever you really can envision. You've got storage closets 
all along here, four of them, double doors. And then you've got windows bringing in some light, but you can make this into your office, into your little studio, you know, music studio maybe. You can make it into anything you really want. So I love this. It's a little added bonus that the house has to add a little bit of extra flavor to it. I love it. It's a nice little spot, nice carpeted, looks good. Recessed lighting was added as well with all new ceiling. Turn this one into whatever you'd like. All right, everybody, I wanna thank you for joining us on this wonderful home tour in Kensington, California, here at this beautifully remodeled property. My name is Cameron Chatterton with Chatterton Homes Group, powered by Twin Oaks. I wanna thank the listing agent for letting us tour the home as well on this beautiful day. Ruben behind the camera, who's done an amazing job. And I wanna see you guys on the next video. So please like and subscribe on the YouTube channel. It helps us out a lot and we'd love to see you on the next one. Until then, we'll see you later. Have a great day, everybody.